What's going on guys? Hank here, bringing you guys another video. And in today's video, we'll do a little something different. We did a little best of part one. There's gonna be two parts, but this is part one. Um, right now I'm in the new shop. To give you guys a brief tour. It's a work in progress. As you can see, we started putting shoes on the shelf to see how it would look. Trying to do different backers, like right here, this is, we tested it with the blue. I don't like it, but uh, comment down below, tell me what you guys think. Um, everything will be separated into sizes, smallest to biggest. Here's another part. This is all inventory. It's all the new inventory we've been buying this month, we've actually been bringing here. I've had to walk down here a few times and actually grab something because somebody wanted it. But nonetheless, plenty of inventory over here. This will be the section where we'll do like Pokemon and sports cards and all that stuff. And also we'll take our cleaning, as you can see our nice little cleaning sign. I believe this is going to be backlit. Uh, and then we're doing some other stuff right in here. So this is your first look at what's going on. Uh, as of right now, we have the kids wall right here and the women's wall over there. Uh, but it's going to be changing because we have until March 1st. March 1st, we'll be opening this new spot right here. But I want you guys to get a first look at it and see how we're going. Uh, after that, after this first look, you'll see where how we started at the original sneaker tech, which was down the hall. Well, we kind of outgrew that spot very quickly. So I wanted to show you guys a sneak peek of this before, how it's going to look. And then you guys can see what's going to happen uh, in the second video of the finished product before grand opening. Um, without further ado, let's roll those old clips, please. Um, we're stopping off at the mall. We're going to go inside and show you where the store is going to be located at. Uh, I'm going to time lapse it on the walk in, obviously, because um, it just makes sense to do that. You don't need to see every footstep I make. But, uh, and then we're going to head over to another store to see if we can find more school supplies. So stay tuned for that, guys. All right, it's gonna to be tough to see inside of there, but this is where it's gonna be at. If you can see in there, it's not super big, but it's big enough for what we need it for. Tough. All right, guys, we're here at the shop, uh, or shop that's coming soon, August 1st. And here they are. So let's uh, open this bad boy up. Now, I, it's an automatic door lock, so I think we just... Uh, it needs a little bit of work, but hopefully we'll be okay. Uh, a lot of this stuff. Um, but yeah, this is, this is where the magic's gonna happen. And, Pretty excited. It's a little dark in here. We gotta get the uh, lights turned on and all that good stuff. But uh, yeah, we gotta patch some holes. <laughs> but as you can see, we got the slide walls already built on here, so that's great. I don't have to worry about that. Uh, some of this cabinet, a lot of this cabinet tree is gonna have to go. But. Uh, so a lot of like random stuff. So. But with that being said, we got a lot of work to do now because August 1st is 30 days away? 30. 30 days away, okay. So stay tuned for more stuff here. Bring you guys another video. Uh, today we are in the shop. It is July 13th or 12th? What's today, 12th or the 13th? 13th. July 13th. And uh, so we got the wall pretty much painted. We just had to do some touch up. I mean, up there has to be touched up and then we'll have the border go across. We bought the vinyl border. Uh, it has to be thrown up. We're getting a sign for up in here. Uh, it'd be a nice little sign. Uh, we started putting shoes on the wall a little bit just to kind of give it a little bit more effect. Well, I wouldn't say effect, but a little bit more uh, excitement to the shop. As you guys, you guys can look right in when the gate's down. What's cool about 
the mall, the escalator is right there. Food court is right there. And right around the corner from the food court is the entrance. So, got the sign out obviously, and then obviously the Hank to Tank shirt. You guys wear the Hank to Tank shirt to opening day, which is August 1st. I will give you 10% off your order. If you do not own a Hank to Tank shirt, you can go ahead and purchase one of those at www.sneakertechstore.com or you can find them on Instagram or you can just DM me at sneaker.tech underscore. I might be changing my Instagram name soon. I gotta see if it's available. Nonetheless, so the walls are set up as follows right now. I have to buy some more shelving. Uh, but other than that, uh, I didn't realize how much shelving this was gonna take. But uh, I have some ideas to make sure that we have plenty of shoes out if I don't get the shelves in time. Uh, so this will be the men's wall, the women's wall, uh, the kids wall on this will most likely be the hype wall or you know the new new exclusives or whatever is coming out at that time in question um so as of right now that's the, the planned setup obviously things can change but that's kind of how i want it right now uh and the, obviously i'm just throwing the shoes on the shelf again we have a ton of shoes i think we have about 300 pairs total uh but i just want to get shoes on the shelf to see how it looks and uh We'll have a photographer coming in soon to actually take pictures of the store to make it a little bit more official. Um, but definitely want to make sure that we have stuff up when people walk by, even if it isn't the best stuff. But we've been kind of working all day, trying to get stuff together. It's kind of got to leave out, bring a carload of stuff back and forth. But nonetheless, let's get right into it. This is the men's wall. Um, it's not filled, obviously. But nonetheless, we're gonna have a ton of stuff on here. This is just some of the things that we're gonna have um, in the shop. And then I got my, my height case, so to speak. But um, this will be ever changing out. We'll change it out all the time. Put hype shoes in there, we'll put different things in there, but kind of just to start it out. Uh, next up is the women's wall. Um, I'm waiting on some shelving. Shout out to Sneaker Connect. I'll post their Instagram, go check them out. They actually said they had some of these left over and uh, they were gonna get and ship them to me. All I had to do is provide the label. So I went ahead and, you know, sent the label over, which is great because again, just one sneaker store helping another. I'm really um, excited about that. I really appreciate that. We, he, he's actually bought a few things um, from me. So uh, next time I'm in Florida, I definitely gotta check them out. He is located in Florida. Like I said, go check them out on Instagram. Pretty good stuff that they have. Uh, next up is the kids wall right here again just getting the shelving and I'll get this filled up come August 1st everything will be retail Carmine size 6 retail Jordan 1 mid retail retail so I am Jordan 4 size 6 retail so I am putting stuff in retail um, everything will be at retail. Next up, another case. Uh, start putting a couple of uh, Getting the store together a little bit more. Uh, I appreciate everybody that gave me some uh, feedback about the store so far. I've been taking it into consideration, obviously. Um, it's a lot of work, and we got two weeks away, so we're less than two weeks now. I think it's 13 days. But uh, yeah, so I uh, got this little bad boy in today. It's nice little countertop rack. As you can see, we got keychains. And we also got cards. Now these are pre-made packs. I uh you know I like I like ripping the cards instead of just store them in a box and collect dust. I went ahead and made packs. I mean I like the NBA packs, five bucks, MLB, football. Uh, and then the Pokemon right here is hollows and reverse hollows and uh, those are also five bucks I was actually looking up some of these prices of these and I'm kind of surprised like some of them are like worth two three dollars each um, But that's pretty cool. So I got a ton more pairs of sneakers to put out see over here um, And just you know doing minor things here and there I'm still waiting on the shelving So that's why it's still looking the same and guys just keep in mind that 
you know, a lot of people were mentioning about having hype stuff or heat. I get that stuff in, but it moves so quickly um, that I can't keep it on the shelves. So, I mean, even when I'm, you know, when I out the back of the basement, I couldn't keep it on the shelf. So obviously, I'm going to try to sell it and, and turn a profit. So if I'm just sitting on it, it's not. Today is July 25th, and we are just about done. As you can see, we got some signs on the wall finally, which I love. Some pretty cool signs. Also, started putting signs up in the specific areas, men's, women's, kids. Uh, this has a sign for like the exclusive wall. This would be the ever, this wall will change all the time. But uh, this has right now just you no know, more exclusive stuff, dunks. Off whites, easies. I'll have some clothing this week to put up on this wall. Uh, and then there's the box that has to put the rack up for the new uh, clothing rack. So, again, this will be, this store will be forever changing. And I'm pretty excited that, you know, I'm initially setting it up and hopefully it will look good and stuff like that. We have overflow of shoes. We have plenty more shoes that has to go out. I got my buddy Noah over there hanging out. We were just pulling some shoes that we sold on the website and uh, sold on IG. You can go check out the website, www.sneakertechstore.com to purchase your shoes, your shirts, all that good stuff. If you see something on Instagram that you don't see on the website, I'd be glad to throw it up on the website for you. I'm still getting the website together to make sure that it is fully functional um but yeah got some unions down there you guys saw in the previous video uh so we are today is sunday if i didn't mention that and we're one week away what's going on sneaker world the day has finally arrived august 1st it is finally here and this is where it all began in my unofficial studio where we started filming and taking a dream and a concept and putting it into reality. Uh, I got goosebumps right now just thinking about it. But nonetheless, this is where it began and we are headed off to the store to, you know, put stuff out before we open. And I'm pretty excited. It's just, just so real that today is the day that I can say I'm opening my own store and just pretty, pretty cool. And, uh, just, I don't know what to say. Like, I'm, I'm just excited. I'm speechless and it was a lot of hard work, but it's finally happening. So I'm sure I'll be still filming down in here, but <laughs> who knows? You know, I might keep it strictly in the store. I don't know. Don't know what the future holds. Didn't know I was going to be opening my store until I put my mind to it. So you guys can do it. Anybody can do it. You know, I always, I, I'm a big advocate of, you know, if you put your mind to something in life, you can definitely pull it off. And here we are. Hour away, two hours away. I think it's like almost 930. Let me check my clock. It is 912. So... A little over two or a little under two hours away from opening and i'm pretty excited so with that being said guys stay tuned for more stuff what's going on sneaker world did you hit the right button <laughs> my wife did hit the right button it's blanking. Okay. It's blanking. <laughs> we are here today as you saw my little morning speech we are officially at the store and i'm pretty excited and we're going to do the uh ribbon cut ceremony to really uh give that Opening, opening yeah, I opening guess. I, I seen this in a lot of other videos, so I said, screw it, I'm gonna do it myself. Who else can say they can cut a ribbon to their own store, you know what I mean? So, without further ado, let's cut this ribbon. <laughs> cheers. Oh, you went cheers? Don't try to say them, guys. There it is. Yay! 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 <laughs> <laughs> Try not to cry right now. <laughs> All right, so you got some stuff to bring in, what you yeah. got? Oh, Hyper Royal, okay. 
fire shield. He's actually been doing pretty well. We had like almost a whole side of him down to two sizes left, so good shield. Uh, through your personal? No, I have a, I have a personal. Oh, you have a personal. I was going to say, I thought, I thought you were saying that. But yeah, I, we've been doing really well. Mids, you know, it's funny. People hate on mids, but like, they've been doing really well, so. And then what else you got? Nine and a half. Nine and a half. I'll take that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then you got some smoke rays. Okay. All brand new, right? All brand new. Jordan wants to know. Alright, so you, you say you want to do like part time assignment, part trade? Yeah. Okay. You said you need a nine and a half? Nine, sure. Or nine? Okay. You, need to, you need to try it on or? Uh, no. Okay, good. Okay. So this is two six then. Uh, and then consignment, how do you want to handle that? Like you, which, well, how do you want to do the trade? Uh, that's how much if I can trade. So these, these I've been, oh, sorry. These I've been buying these at, at two. Okay. Uh, these I've been buying at retail for, oh, uh, no, not retail, I've been buying these for 120. Yeah. So this, if you want, what we can do is do these two for 320. Hold on, man, what you got for sale today? I got some brick. Jordan wants to see this. Okay. Did you just say, were you about to say bricks? No. No. Oh. <laughs> I got them on sneakers on that. On the restock release? Yeah. That's it's the only one I hit, of course. And I was like, I'll go for a size 11 and a half. Well, if it makes you feel any better, I didn't hit none of them. So. Okay. Okay. And they're UNC, though, so one that just came out. Okay. 5.5. How much were you looking for on these? 95. 95. And I saw the one in the bag before we started filming. Which one are those? So there's some white Oreo fours. I was looking like 290. I could do probably 280. I probably wouldn't go lower than that. Oh, uh, we can do 280 on these if you want to do 280. That's fine. You know what? Do 280. Want to do 280? All right, cool. So I'll take these. And uh, how much are you looking for on these? 180. 180. Uh, I can do 180. That's retail is 170. So that would be fair. And then these. Are you going any lower on these? I'd probably check the 95. 95. So, with that being said, guys, stay tuned for more stuff. I mean, when you're yeah. you small businesses, your fees are a lot higher. Just yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean, if we were to, you know, I mean, do that, it's kind of tough. So, for us. So, all right, so you're, you're grabbing these. Fire shoot. Fire. <laughs> <laughs> She's still trying on shoes over there. I think this is, is my foot just too big for this or what? Want to loosen it up for Alright guys, so it's been a very eventful day and we've been super busy. You guys know that I keep saying I'm capping and I'm not busy. So we went ahead and hired somebody for the day. Y'all know who it is. Do they? Hank the Tank 2.0. Henry 2.0. Henry 2.0 came through and stopped by. He's going to help, uh, help out in the shop. Uh, hopefully we can do some. But you missed all the good buys earlier. Everybody likes to show up work to late. Uh, show up work. Well, I can even call so it. Yeah. yeah. He showed up late. She showed up late. I showed up on time. He showed up and hasn't done nothing all day, Noah. I mean, so. <laughs> but, of course, I'm going to be late. Well, I don't know anything about that. Yeah. I was I was actually I got here at one o'clock, so I can't even complain. <laughs> I was late today too. <laughs> that doesn't I got here at twelve fifty nine. Oh he was with me, so he was late. I was, I was no late. I was here at twelve fifty nine. No, yeah. He was working faster than you. Yeah, he did. He I was here at twelve fifty nine, you were here at one. Yeah, I don't know about that buddy. But anyway, we bought a ton of shoes today. We're trying to get them price put out. There's still a stuff. We got about probably twenty five pairs we're still trying to go through and process and Get on the website and into our inventory. So we got a lot of work to do. I think first what we'll do is obviously, you know, you know the vibes. We're gonna price some shoes. This is one of the ones we picked up today. Uh, somebody unlaced it. How you doing, man? Uh, 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 that's gray. That's your size. I think eight and a half or nine. Nine. Size? nine. Oh, you nine. like that shoe? It's clean, but I'm a ten, ten and a half, and I like that blue. I like that blue too. I uh, got this in. I'd rather get the UNC, bro. I got you this. Yeah. 
as you saw in the previous clip, we went ahead and made our first deal of the day and we made it on our brand new certified pre-owned glass case. This is the one we've been waiting for it to come in. It's finally here, pretty excited about that. We were thinking about using this case as our main case, but we can't because we have to follow ADA regulations. So for now, we'll have to stick with this thing. So, but we try to put some stuff in here. I mean, as being a new shop, we buy what comes in and stuff like that. So uh, we put, you know, we, we put some of the better stuff in here and then obviously filled up the wall with some other stuff and we still have the pre-owned section down there. Gerald don't want to be in the video. Let's try to hide. What are you going to try to hide, dog? Now you're in the video for sure. Huh? 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 But anyway, still got some more school supplies to give away. Yeah, I, you know, it's funny. I, when you said you were coming, I was like, he's probably gonna bring some bangers. So I'm actually redoing the walls so I can put some stuff out so I can put some better stuff in the yeah, case. So I was kind of preparing. Uh, I'll do, I'll do 40 on these. Okay, I'll let you have one. 40. Save the best for last. Yeah, okay. This is a fire shield. These haven't been doing well though. Or at least when I last checked. I had three pair I sold to I sold to I didn't really make as much as I wanted to do. My buddy and I were talking about these the other day actually. 